Interior. A room. Day. Thomas leans into a microphone. If you want to smash out a screenplay or 50 on your Chromebook, here's a quick roundup of the best tools on the scene. Ha, ah, scene. I'm mainly going to cover screenwriting programs which actually provide a nice graphical interface and auto formatting for screenplays. There are of course methods like using fountain script which allow you to use just any basic text editor to write great screenplays if that path appeals to you. First of all, let's hit a few web apps. The benefits of web applications include that there's no install necessary and they often provide the best cloud backup and online collaboration features. Writer Duet is the big doggy in town in these respects. It's feature rich, very popular and on the up and up. Writer Duet has a limited free version and a number of paid tiers. This is one of the ones that are going to hide most of their best features behind a paywall. A much simpler alternative is youmescript.com. This website keeps it very simple. You go there, you write your script. It's that easy. It's mostly free with an optional paid version for particularly offline features. It's only like $25 for a year. And the guy who develops Yumi Script seems like a fairly just nice guy, so that's nice. Thirdly, there is Celtex, which used to be this great free screenwriting program that we would all use but now they've gone very exclusive they seem to be aiming right at professionals and businesses and as such their service is very slick and impressive but pretty much all of it is hidden behind an expensive paywall their free version seems very limiting so I find Celtex difficult to recommend unless you don't mind paying a fair bit for it or you're a part of a team or something maybe the whole team gets in and that could work out well Let's hit some Linux apps, shall we? Wow, exciting. Um, Fade In is a very professional program, often compared to Final Draft. If your Chromebook can run Linux apps, it is very easy to install Fade In. You just download the dev package, install it, voila. Seems to work perfectly to me. Fade In is a very respectable program. It's not free, but it comes at a very respectable price of about $80, much less than Final Draft, etc. Another Linux option is Kit Scenarist, and this one's actually my personal fave at the moment. It's free, though you can pay a little to get a cloud backup service. Um, it's open source, it's got a lovely chap running it, he helped me out just yesterday, he's lovely. And it's growing and developing rapidly. Now if you're new to Linux, it just takes a little chickity chick to uh, install Kit Scenarist properly. I'll just go through that really quickly now, it's not hard, once it's installed it works perfectly. So all you have to do is go to the Kit Scenarist website, download the deb package, install it, just like Fade In, but then when you try to launch Scenarist, it's gonna say, I need these things. So all you need to do to fix this is type a couple of lines of code into the terminal. I've put them in the description. There are these two little packages you need to install and then launch Scenarist and you should be all good. So of course, Final Draft is the industry standard, which is a term that I don't really like for some reason. It puts me well off. But it's the industry standard for screenwriting, and if you really were set on using Final Draft on your Chromebook, I reckon you probably technically could if you installed it through Wine on Linux. But I just, unless you're really tied to Final Draft, it's just not worth it, I reckon. Finally, there are, of course, some Android apps that you can screen write in. Mainly, these are just the mobile versions of some apps I've already talked about, like Fade In, Writer Duet, Celtex, Final Draft. There's also one called Dubscript, seems pretty good. And if you don't mind just writing with Fountain Script, there are simple, lovely little text editors like Jotapad on Android. In review, my recommendation is that if you're after something very simple and just want to get typing away right now, then go with Yumi Script. If you want something feature rich and exciting and don't want to pay very much, then go for Kit Scenarist. And if you're after truly professional, dependable screenwriting software, then go for Fade In on Linux. And finally, if you want all of the features and great online collaboration tools and don't mind paying a little bit more, then Writer Duet might be for you. Are there any I've missed? Comment below, I'd love to know. Best regards. Bye-bye.